Hey, everybody! You can hear me. Okay, good, good, good. I sometimes mess that up. My Welcome to Once Upon a Tabletop, the gaming show where we get together and play a board game and role play the action at the table. My name is Bobby Frankemer. I'm just one of your three hosts on the show here tonight. With me also, as usual, is my co host, uh, Cliff, aka Mr. Johnson. Cliff, um,. Lightning question, how, what is the easiest way to tell, uh, if someone is a Cylon? Lightning question. <laughs> I, I really have no idea. That's Just good have enough. To shoot them. That's good enough for me. Um, if you had known an answer, that might, might, uh, we might suppose you are, you in fact are a Cylon, because it takes one to know one, right? Everybody knows that schoolyard, <laughs> uh, truism. Uh, my other co-host is Ozcore. Oz, tell us uh, what game we're going to be playing tonight. We're playing Battlestar Galactica, the board game by Fantasy Flight. That's right, and we're uh, we're excited to do it. Also with us tonight, we have two other guests, like we always do on this show, have guests with us. Our first guest tonight, uh, you may have seen her uh, streaming on Twitch, vlogging on YouTube, or having a ridiculous amount of fun over there on the Tabletop RPG channel. Roll for it. Say hello to Margaret Crone. Hello, Maggie. Hey. How's it going? Thanks for having me. Um, it's going all right. I'm a little sick, so I apologize for oh, that in you know, advance. That is, that is okay. Here, I'm powering through it. Yeah, I'm sick as well. I have a, I actually have a quick question for you. What is a CMO? Because I was looking on your webpage, and I saw that you had listed that you were the CMO for Roll For It, and I'm hoping it stands for Chief Medical Officer. <laughs> you could say that, but it's Chief Marketing <laughs> Officer. Chief Marketing but Officer. But you know, marketing, sure. I'm basically, I like revive the internets for them, sure. That's right, that's right. You uh, you give uh, CPR to their uh, public Please. presence. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> um, and finally, uh, we have the with us the co-creator of the Emerald Grid Shadowrun community, the voice of Mika on Tales from the Stuffer Shack, and the best co-host I've ever had on a podcast, Cassie Levitt. Yes. Am I the only co-host you've ever had on a podcast? Um, Cliff, you have a podcast with Cliff. Save yourself. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, I, <laughs> you're way better than Cliff. Fantastic. All right, I win this round. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So, um, yeah, tonight we're going to be playing um, Battlestar Galactica, the board game, and it's all about playing the game together and role-playing the action at the table. That's what we do here. Oz, I would like you, while I do the things that everybody else has already done on here, but uh, I was too busy talking to the stream, why don't you tell everybody, just real quick, a brief explanation of how this game works so that we can get going and get to it. This is sure. Bobby's excuse because he doesn't know how it works. Yes. <laughs> so, I so uh, <laughs> all right, well, without going too deep into the rules, basically we all get one move, one action, and those actions can come from a variety of things, including our character cards, as well as skill cards, uh, abilities on the board, on the map, and, uh, and such. Um, one or more of us, possibly none of us currently, is a Cylon. We all just received a uh, special identity card, and uh, two of the cards in the deck say that you are a Cylon. However, we've only dealt out half of the cards because when we reach the sleeper agent phase, we're gonna receive the next set of cards, at which point we know for sure there will be two Cylons. But right now, both Cylons may be amongst us, maybe just one or maybe none. So um, the idea is Cylons are to work against the humans covertly until they decide that they want to, as their action, reveal themselves and they have a special action on their Cylon card to are we allowed ruin to do everything. That on show? Reveal. Uh, sorry, what? bad joke. If you didn't I missed get your joke. No, sorry. <laughs> you I'm, said like, I'm in this yourself. Zone. And reveal then I yourself. tried to make a lewd joke, and it right, didn't. Right, right, right. Gotcha. No. I, I'm, I'm, I always reveal myself on this show. It's, um, we've been, we've been warned a couple of times from Twitch. So. <laughs> um, and yeah, I mean, that's that's all I really think that we should get into. Um, at the end of every turn that we take, uh, we are going to draw a crisis card, and those crises we have to solve cooperatively but the Cylons can work against us by playing cards uh, that are not part of that skill check. 
Uh, other things, uh, we have a president and an admiral. So I think maybe before we uh, before we specifically discuss how those work, I think maybe we should just introduce our the characters that we're going to play as well as our special abilities. Also, real fast, tell me what draw cards was I supposed to draw? Oh, you draw you draw a total of three skill cards uh, from any deck uh, of your choice that you can draw from. Oh, so those okay, are the okay. colors on your sheet. So you can get like all of one color or you can get a variety, but go ahead and grab whichever of those that you would like. So I'm going to draw, for example, I'm going to draw one. I'm going to draw two green and one yellow. Got it. Okay. So everyone go ahead and fill up your hands. And um, do we have a first player to marker going around? Yes, we do. Wait, no, we don't. I'm turn it, it off so it doesn't have, because right now I have two rows of my cards. It's weird. <laughs> I didn't have that before, and now I do. It's weird. Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. I, like the row of cards here, but then I also have a row of cards like. Oh yeah, down that's. Below. Yeah, those are the ones that are face down. Like, um, that's just to show your cards. They're not face up um, to the other players, but yeah, I know like, that. I'm seeing them all face. Up. Okay, then yeah. Um, no, 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 Ryan, you're not getting what I'm saying, so it's fine. I, no. Basically, so, I have two rows of my own cards. It's really weird. That is weird. Mm. Okay. Also, um, I'm seeing Maggie and Cliff. You guys drew too many cards. You're supposed to just have three. So just. Uh, I did draw set, and it gave me that many. Yeah. Uh, at the start of the game, we have to draw three. So you can't draw set on the first round. Oh, I looked I that up. Put them away, so I don't know what to do. <laughs> <laughs> um, just toss them on the table, and then we'll. Yeah. Okay. I'll put them back. Anyway, um, while while that's uh, our housekeeping is being done there, uh, let's um, let's introduce characters, yeah. Yes, let's do that. I'll go first while you guys uh, are work on that. Um, I am tonight uh, Colonel Saltai, and um, he's a uh, you know he's he's the salty sailor of the uh, of the Battlestar Galactica. He's um he's a uh, he's. Uh, he he worships worship is he worships uh, Admiral Adama and he's all about uh, making sure that we get our our ourselves away from those filthy Cylons and um, and and doing it in the the best military fashion possible. So he and he's always drunk. There's no salt in space tie. <laughs> <laughs> I was born with salt. In my veins. <laughs> <laughs> That's really good. <laughs> Get ready. We need you now. I am Admiral Dama, commander of the Battlestar Galactica. Uh huh. You're darn That's right. That's all I got. Would you want something else? <laughs> I'm yeah. the military leader here. I have the nukes, literally. I have the nu Yeah, you do. Yeah, you are the admiral of the are ship. Are we missing so, a yes. deck for red cards? Mm, no, it's here. Which, where is it? This one here. Okay, I pulled something from there and it was not red. Oh, Strange. that might have been a, a miss place. Okay. Anyway. <laughs> okay. There we go. Cool. Okay. <laughs> all right, I think we're I think we're we're all set now. Yeah. Good. Yeah. So who's next? Who's next? Uh, um, Maggie, what? Who are you? Who are you playing tonight? Um, I'm playing Sharon Boomer Valari, and I'm totally not a Cylon. <laughs> I, got. I gotta represent my Asian homies because there's only one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, geez. Let's see. Okay, and uh, Cliff. Hello, I am playing Kara Thrace, or Starbuck, the hotshot Viper pilot. I'm here to kill some toasters. Yeah. But I like toast. But do you like toasters? That's the important thing. I mean, they make toast, so I kind of have to like toasters, right? Sounds like Cylon talk to me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. I guess you can like or dislike whatever you want, Boomer. 
Um, <laughs> Thanks. But uh, we, I can't I'm glad promise you're not me to, permission to like what I want. I can't promise <laughs> we won't hold that against you. Um, <laughs> uh, real quick, before we get started here, I guess we should uh, mention, as always, especially if you're new to the show, that uh, we don't just role play the stuff at the table. Um, we don't just have fun showing off these games, but one special thing we like to do to get everybody um, excited and and uh, and and having a lot of fun here is um, we have this this cool thing called uh, the wheel of uh, the once upon a wheel. It's this it's this fun wheel that that uh, that we we get to spin on the show sometimes, and it has it has really cool uh, things on here that change things up. Like uh, like odds, what are some examples of things that you might spin on this wheel? And then I'll explain how uh, you spin it. Things that you might spin are you can give characters extra skill cards or take them away. Uh, you might also uh, launch more Cylon ships, ruin our day, trigger uh, a scene with a character with between two characters or with an NPC from the show. Um, all kinds of random fun thing ways to mess up or help our day yeah exactly and it's always a blast it always uh throws a wrench in things because we hardly ever get the things spun that that help us out it's usually the things that hurt See, us. and he said it was fun so definitely a cylon yeah. <laughs> <laughs> i can neither confirm nor deny that um <laughs> but uh the way that you end up spinning the wheel is uh, you you beat the stream boss. The stream boss is down there below my picture right now, and, and uh, if you're not familiar, you, you the, the stream boss takes damage by uh, by cheering, subscribing, following, all those kinds of things. So once the uh, once it gets all the way down, and then you become, if you land the killing blow on the stream boss, you become the stream boss, and then your name gets up there, but also you will spin, at that moment, will spin the wheel, something will get picked, and then you, the new stream boss get the honor of deciding who amongst us that uh that that terrible thing or or great thing applies to so it's a fun thing it 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 throws a wrench in all of our fun so who's going first and how do we play i mean you know we'll learn as we go sure um first okay that's fine you're president i did not introduce myself i i am hello i am president laura roslin i uh, was, I believe, 47th. It was either 42nd or 47th in line. Uh, but when humanity was, when Caprica and the 12 colonies were destroyed, I was the first in line. And I am now in charge of the, of the fleet, the fleet's well-being of my constituents. Mm -hmm. And I work with, I work with the commander to some capacity to ensure that our, that we are safe. Yeah, let's be clear now. You're in charge of uh, political matters and all those matters of military issue fall under uh, our Admiral, Adama. As well as you, the XO. If, 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 if he so places me in charge, that's correct. Or if he's sleeping. <laughs> All right. So, quick reminder to our players to review your character card. Make sure that you understand your abilities. And if you have any questions, let me know. Should I have already drawn a loyalty card? <clears throat> yes. <laughs> yeah, I told you to draw a loyalty card. Just one. There you go. Just one. Okay. Just one. Okay. So, uh, the situation currently is we have uh, a set, we have a base star and three Cylons. All right, let's get started. Uh, President Roslin uh, is currently on Colonial One in the president's office, and she is going to, hmm, I guess, I don't really have anything. Unfortunately, I don't have anything in my hand currently that would actually be beneficial. So I am going yes, to. to <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm going to play my. Oh shit! If I okay, so I have a terminal illness. I I do have cancer, which I haven't told anybody. But um, in order to activate a location, I have to discard two skill cards. Ugh. 
I really want to do the president's office, but I'm not going to. So I'm going to do instead my president ability to draw a quorum card into my hand. I'm actually supposed to, actually wait, I'm supposed to start with a quorum card. Let me see, do I want this? Uh, okay. No, I will draw a quorum card. Okay. So that was my, I decided not to move and that was my action. So that ends my turn. So now we're going to go ahead and draw a, our first crisis. Mm. Prisoner revolt. Uh, Tom Zarek walks in and says, before I release my captives, I demand the immediate resignation of Laura Roslin and her ministers. Mm. Um, so, <laughs> So, uh, we have a skill check. 11 yellow, green, purple, already insurgency. Uh, pass, Jeez. no effect. If we pass by six plus, we only lose one population because if there's a prisoner revolt, literally all these prisoners have a bunch of guns and they're about to start a riot, um, or fail, we lose a population and President Rosalind chooses another player to receive the president's title. Ooh, because you get ousted. Yes, there's already mutiny right now. We're in the middle of a Cylon attack, and this is what now is. Of course, Tom Zarek would do it now. That snake. All right, so let's, uh, we need to set up a destiny deck. And two cards are going to come from the destiny deck. So they could be any color and may already be hindering or sabotaging us. If anybody has a, um, investigative committee if they would like they could play that they could play that yellow card face up to play to have all the cards played face up into the check oh. to make sure that we don't overshoot our mark here all right when do we play that do we go around and i pick cards or you just throw it down now uh you can throw it down right now all right i'm in command here <laughs> so that means we all have to put our cards all skill cards are going to be played face up, including the destiny decks. So okay. let's see what we've got currently. We've got a uh, red one, which does not count. So that's a net, that's a minus one. And then a plus four purple. So we're at, we're currently at three. Okay. So does that mean any of our cards that get put in also will be faced up? They, yes. Okay. So starting with, All right, starting with Adama. Uh, yellow, green, and purple. All right, Ty, take care of this. Of course. All right. <laughs> Does this, um, oh yeah, we're passing that thing around. Yep. Done, there you go. Make sure, uh, yeah. <laughs> it put it in there upside down. <laughs> yeah, flip it over. <laughs> <laughs> it's five. All right, so right now it's um, it's it's Cliff, right? Yep. Starbucks. Yeah. Eight here. So we're currently, yeah, we're currently at eight. Um, so Rosalind, Rosalind looks over to um, sends a message out and says. We shouldn't be wasting further resources on this revolt. Well, I'll be damned if I'm gonna let that snake Zarek pull some crap like this in the middle of a Cylon attack. Well, the way I see it, what's a few insurgent prisoners less? With all due respect, Madam President, this is a military matter, <laughs> and, uh, We've got this under control. All right, nine plus three, that's 12 minus one, 11. All right, so that, that'll that pass it. So unless anybody wants to play any negative cards face up. <laughs> I don't have time to deal with this politics. Get me to a Viper, we're under attack. So we need everyone to put Dunn on their thing if we want to pass it up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, but so what's his? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, there we go. Then it's on me. Um, cool. And now it's on me. Done. Or pass. There we go. Excellent. 
Okay, I will not contribute. Sounds good to me. I'm busy anyway. All right, so this passed. Totally so not doing so things. <laughs> <laughs> All right, this passed, so there's no effect. Um, go ahead and return all the... Uh, wait, these all have to be played face up. Uh, I think we can say return. Uh, can somebody put these back in there in the discards? Thanks. Oh, in the discard? Yep. All right, so heavy raiders activate. So we don't have a heavy raider on board. So we're going to place one at the... It's launching from the base star. And the... Uh, and we also have FTL preparation so our ftl jump preparation track is going to move forward one space mm. all right that ends that ends my crisis so passing passing my turn to uh we're going clockwise correct so boomer all right so i'm going i i just pull a crisis card right no you take a move and okay. an action um, so there are, is this Viper ship here, and I'd have to move to the hangar, right, to take care of that? Correct. Okay. Um, so I move there, and then I, then I do an action. Yes. Which is a card. Uh, let's see what, what I got. Well, if you do, if you do your action card, mm -hmm. um, then you're not using the the hangar deck location. Oh. Because the hangar deck location is an action. Okay, launch yourself in a Viper. You may then take one more action. Okay. So I I go out. You can go there. out of either of these two if you want. So you can actually launch in this space as well. So you're closer oh, okay. to the... There's a little oh, token gotcha. underneath your die for your... Um, that seems more dangerous. Viper. I'll go right here first. Um, do I need like a little viper? Yep. There you go. Oh, oh. never mind. I see. Look this at, is us. Look at that little viper. Here. I'm so cute. Look at me. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Do a barrel um, And then I don't use a card. Well, you can I take one more action. action. So if you want, you can, that can be your, your action can be to use a card. Oh, okay. Uh, it's a little confusing because, yeah, to launch yourself in a Viper, you have to spend your action, but then it allows you to take one more action after. So then you can play a card from your hand or you can okay. move into the space if you want. But but I have to be in this other space over here in order to attack those guys, right? Like they have to be in my space. Correct. Also, you have a little token, kind of like the one that I just placed for myself that's meant to be... Um... The thing you put your viper on, I think. Oh, okay, mm. I can do that. Me, I didn't realize we had those. Viper. I liked how you were balancing yours on the thing, though. Mm -hmm. Cool. But I have to start in this ring, right? <laughs> uh. Or does it really matter? I'm just anywhere. Yeah, as long as it's in this this quadrant. quadrant. Okay. But I can't attack the ones in the other quadrant. Right, no. Your so action would have to just be... I actually can't do any more. Action. Um, so now I grab a crisis card? Well, do you... If you have an action in your hand, you can take that. Yeah, but I can't because I need to be in the, in the square to be able to do it. Uh, then, yeah, then you're done. Unless okay. you want to, unless you want to move into their space, but then you're going to be their their first target. Well, I can't move into their space. I already used my movement action. Oh right. Oh no. Uh, can you take a second? You can take. You can use your action to move twice, or to move an extra space rather when you're in a viper. Hmm. I don't think I want to move there and not do anything. Probably <laughs> not a good idea. Like, yeah. It sounds like. Hi. I'd like to die. Please shoot me. No. <laughs> um, okay, now I grab a crisis card. Yes. Yeah. All right. Let's see. Let's see, food shortage. I cannot read that because I am blind. I got it for you. I got it for you. Okay. It says, uh, "Well, Laura Roslin says it." Oh. So, Laura Roslin, you read it. 
Oh yeah, Laura should say yeah. this. Get the names of those ships. Tell the captains to go on emergency rations immediately. All we'll right. see how long this president this incursion will continue. So if we fail, the president chooses one of the two outcomes? Oh, there's actually no, there's actually no skill check on this. It just oh. says president chooses. What? We either lose two food or minus one food, and then I lose two skill cards, and then Boomer loses three skill cards. Holy shite. Damn, that's a lot of skill cards. <laughs> What's the choice, Captain? Or uh, president uh, Presidente? Oh, geez. Um... We we don't know how long the Cylons will be hunting us. I don't feel it's prudent for us to lose so much food, especially given that we started very low to have a quick to have a quicker game. So I'm going to choose the second option of minus one food, and you lose three skill cards, Boomer, and I'm going to lose two. Okay, it's cool because I also like food. So, I'm cool with this. I'm speaking on behalf of myself. <laughs> <laughs> oh, did you also draw your set at the start of your turn? No, I, I didn't. I didn't. I didn't do that either, actually. So that was a that was an oopsies on my part. Okay, and oh, I get fine. to do one more okay. thing before the end of my turn. Uh, no. That's it. Yes, I do. Recon. At the end of your turn, you may look at the top card at the crisis and place it on the top or bottom. So don't tell me what I can and cannot do. Ooh. Mm -hmm. I can do whatever I want. And this is it. So hold on a second. I'm going to look at it and read it. I didn't realize that Boomer could do that. I've never played with Boomer, so. Aww. Uh... Hmm. I don't know, like, that doesn't seem that, I mean, it's terrible, but like, at the same time, it's not that terrible. We've seen some worse ones, so I'm not sure. So you're gonna keep it on top? Yeah, it doesn't, right. I mean, yeah, I don't know. Doesn't seem that bad-ish. I mean. <laughs> <We'll find out. laughs> All right, so raiders are activating. So they're going to work their way to the civilian ships. They're, it's an equal distance, so they move clockwise. Oh, damn it. I should have gone the other way. And Whatever jump preparation track moves forward one. Mm. All right. All right, that ends your turn. The Bay Star and the Heavy Raider don't move? No. Oh. It's just the Raiders. Oh, okay. All right. Uh, salt High. All right. Well, uh... I should receive my skills to start with. Uh, draw set. Okay. Um, let's see. I can uh, do this. Um, move to do 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 and then take it or move to do do. All right, all right, all right. Um, so I will move, but I will uh, not move. I'll stay here because I'm going to activate Vipers. Ooh, nice. All right, because I'm in the command right now where where the captain belongs. Uh, not the captain, the colonel. Sorry, captain. <laughs> um, <laughs> Admiral. Admiral, of course. Commander. But also captain, because the, anyway, I, I don't have to explain Commander. military <laughs> roles to you. <laughs> um, but anyway, I'm in command, and I'm going to activate two. We need to uh, we need to activate vipers. So I'm going to do that. That's my movement and right. my action step. Because I didn't move. So, so your options are: you can launch two vipers, or you can move vipers that are on the board. Can I do a mixture of them, or? Yes, you can do a mixture. So I could launch one Rosalind. and then move one? Yeah, President Rosalind is on the phone and says, we need to protect our civilian ships. 
Okay. Alright. So, you vipers better get your asses to those, um, raiders. So do it. Because <laughs> I said so. Um, and then that's, so that's my action step, right? So then I need to draw mm -hmm. a crisis. Yep. Well, let's, uh, do that and flip it over. And it is loss of a friend. Adama, you, sh you should read that. It's William Adama says it. Uh, I, she was a vital living person aboard my ship for almost two years. She couldn't have been more than just a machine. Could you love a machine? Deep. <laughs> I think that's Boomer. <laughs> but yeah, Boom, but Boomer that. told me she's not a Cylon. <laughs> <laughs> um, Ignore the photo. Ignore the picture. We can just call it some some other. We can just call it a a six. Is this a joke? It's sixes. like yeah. <laughs> all Asians look the same. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> um, so if we pass this, there's no effect, um, but uh, we could also either, the current player being Mead would lose two skill cards, or lose a morale if the current player discards two skill cards. Wait, what? Oh, if that, we, that would be at least a seven, a but not a nine. Yeah, right. I got it. Mm -hmm. I got you. Like a partial success option here. Okay. All right. So, so we need we have nine of yellow track. and green. Yeah, I figured we'd be able to pass it, so... Yeah, so should I start? It didn't seem that bad. I think we've seen other ones that are way worse card-wise. Yeah. So do mm -hmm. I click start check? Uh, yes. So who put this Bloop. card in here? The two that are already there. The Destiny deck. We have to. We always have to place two cards, and uh, those are going to be from any random color. Okay. All right. Aren't we supposed okay. to not tell each other how much we're adding to it? Correct. Okay. We just fudged that the last one, right? But no, the last we, one was because they uh, specifically oh, put the card right, down right, that right, makes right. you have to face your card up. Mm -hmm. All right, well, I'm going to tell you guys, I'm definitely... Con uh oh, hold on. Yeah, this he's is, conflicted because he's a Cylon. <laughs> Let's see, I'm going to... I'm adding, but I'm... Also, also my community no, I have says to contribute you know, first. Like Metal Gear Solid. Hmm? <laughs> Metal Gear Solid. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You look like Snake. Yeah. Sorry, right. it, I, I have to. I have to view so that the stream can see the the board. I have to view it upside down. So I'm always thinking that I'm Rosalind because. I... Um, I'll contribute. It's okay. We don't judge. You could have. I just, just want to be Rosalind. I'm contributing one. I don't know how to do that. Let's <laughs> <laughs> change colors. Too late oh, now. All right. It, it is too late. one. How many cards are in there? I can know that, right? Hey, Jusky, Thanks for. All them tip, all them bits. Yeah, whoa. Good to add to this. Does that mean that the wheel gets spun? Well, it doesn't look like. I think there's one hit <laughs> point left. No. <Nah. laughs> how does that even? I didn't see how much. Um... It is strategically pla strategically purchased. <laughs> yeah. So that so they wouldn't have to. Oh yeah, Jask is a he's a. Uh... A strategically pur purchasing person. <laughs> I like someone with a discriminating wallet. Um, mm -hmm. I don't know what that means. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so, so one more bit, and we can spin that wheel. Yeah, somebody. Um, whose turn is it to add stuff to the check? Uh, Starbuck. It's whoever has that black box in front of them. Yeah, it's Starbuck. Oh, right. Uh, so there's three cards in there. Um, I don't know. I... Before we reveal them, we should uh, shuffle them and then open them. Yeah. People people die in war all the time. I, I can't focus on this right now. <laughs> That's something that a Cylon would definitely say. Yeah, really. Actually, I don't think Let's we have to see. shuffle them because when you put um, when you put layout, it puts them all according to color, so it's easier to count. Holy moly! So um, we'll finish this check, but uh, but Cassie, 
Cassie or Emerald Grid, who I'm assuming is Cassie. <laughs> yes. Uh, put the last <laughs> bit in there. Um, so, so, so Cassie's the stream boss. Um, so we'll in a second when we finish this check, we're gonna spin the wheel and then Cassie's gonna meet out fate onto one of us. All right. Oh, it's my turn. I really should have sat on the other side of the table, huh? Um, all right, I'm putting in. Uh, I can I can put a decent amount into, uh, not exactly a lot, but a decent amount into here. So there we go, done. All right, is that it? I believe so. Uh, Boomer, did you go? Or did you pass? I, okay. I put I put cards in. Okay. All right. Just, you weren't watching. Oh geez, here we go. Here we go. Uh, okay, we, so we lost, only lost, green cards. <laughs> oh yeah, no, this is. Oh wait a second. Oh wow, yeah, no, there's. Oh shit. There was some Cylon activity up in this bitch. For sure. Oh no. For wow. sure. Wow. Because we lost. We're in the the negatives now. I no, think. I just would like to point out that people were saying that I was acting like asylum because I didn't put cards in. Well, let's just say that uh, my my <laughs> my allegiances at this point cannot be questioned. Oh, I, I, not true, else. I don't know I about barely, that. I do. I, don't you get green cards? Crisis at all? I barely yeah, you contribute. get green cards, don't you? Yeah. Well, if you sure weren't sitting on your ass the whole time, then maybe you could have contributed enough to make this worth something. We can get these goddamn flight techs on deck and off their asses, get my Viper ready for launch, then then I'd be out there killing Cylons. Look, I know you think you, uh, you have some special kind of privilege here because you're buddy-buddy with the Admiral, but, you know, I'm getting sick and tired of your of your mouth around here. Buddy, buddy, with the admiral, it's you who's got your nose so, so far up his ass. It's always brown. What did you just say? You get yourself back to your bunk before I send you to the to the brig. <laughs> you you get yourself to your bunk. I got Cylons to kill. Ah, I throw something. <laughs> <laughs> Can you all stop arguing? I'm literally out here by myself. Hero, what the what the frack, man? Get this thing prepped for launch. All right, so we failed. Um, that means we lose a morale, and I discard two skill cards. Correct. Yep. All right. And then I think we just move this here, right? Uh, yeah. Uh, heavy raiders activate. So the heavy raider is going to move towards the loading dock. If it boards. Ooh, I can fight then... them. I think. Right? Yes. Yeah, and if it bo if it uh, activates again, it'll raider? board, Let's and then we'll see. have a centurion on top and uh jump preparation moves forward so we have it we we can if we want launch you mean jump oh i like jump. lunch yes but before we do any of that we have to spin the wheel yay so i have turned away oh, no <laughs> i have turned the wheel on oz do you want to spin it I, I think i have it up already actually i can i can spin it you can go for it um let me it says Spin wheel, spin wheel, spin the wheel. When it says something like attack up to four times, does that mean I can attack like anything? Four ships or four, yeah. Anything that's okay. in your space, four times. I'm guessing okay. that is supposed to be minus two skill cards. Um, yeah, because it's barely over there. Minus two skill cards. Somebody's going to lose two skill cards and Cassie gets and, to decide uh, who it is. <laughs> so we I get don't to. Boomer here at all. What? Do, you I don't, don't really have two cards. No, I don't trust you, Boomer at all. You uh -oh. gonna choose me? Not Boomer, not I, Boomer. I, I, I don't know if at all. Star of Luck, that silly blonde. Okay, I'm gonna pick the one. second in command. I have to. <laughs> Sorry. But like. So, so it's. Now you, now so you Boomer. Cards. Starbuck. Starbuck is losing Starbuck. two skill cards, okay. Okay, Starbuck, okay. I was like, I don't know which ones to get rid of. What the frick, Admiral? You've insulted I'm... my second in command. I can't have that kind of disruption in my chain of leadership. Come on, it's, he's true. drunk. Just look at. Never mind. What does that Fine. have to do with Fred, anything? Just <laughs> get me out there where I can shoot something. Oz, do I take the minus two skill cards option off the wheel? I forgot if that's what we do. Nope. 
Just nope, leave it, keep leave it, it there. on there. Okay. <laughs> All right. All right. And turn passes now to Starbuck. Thanks, Admiral. You didn't have to have my back there, but I'm, I appreciate you doing it. Can't have these disruptions. Not in this crisis. Oh, this is such crap. All right, so I'm going to get in a Viper and launch. Uh, probably still with some sort of hose attached to it because they haven't quite cleared me for launch yet, but I'm pissed. <laughs> <laughs> Just insubordinate. Work out your frustrations on, my... on, on those raiders. <laughs> Oh, did we? Yeah, I'd like a little help oh. out here. Now I come flying out. Oh, geez, there's a heavy raider right there. Yes. And I draw my cards. Actually, I should do that. Yep. Oh, geez. If that thing boards, we're so screwed because that stays with us, even if we jump. It's not going to board. Play maximum firepower and just come out. All the lasers firing. So I get to roll four times and I need a seven or an eight to kill this thing. Yep. Where's my die? Rosalind listens intently to the uh, to the military comms. I've got the raider in my sights. Pew, 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 pew. pew, pew, pew. All right, roll it. I can't find my die. <laughs> I guess I'm going to borrow Adama's die. That sounds like Oh, it's under your cards. It's under your cards. There you go. Stay off my die. Locking it down. Definitely a Cylon. <laughs> Does not compute. Oh, I'm sorry. I can't shoot because I don't have Ah, third shot takes it out. Nice. Excellent. Heavy Raider goes down. And um, I haven't used my move. Can I actually move as well? Do I have to do that before my action? Um, yeah, do you oh, have you to didn't do move into your action? Hand? Your action was to attack four times. Oh, like you, your action was to launch yourself in a Viper, and then you can take one more action, which was to attack four times. Right, so I haven't moved. I have to move before my action, or yes. can I move now after? Yes, because all of those all those actions get carried out in order. Okay. Yeah, it's it's move then action. You have a move and then a action. And one of those actions, your second action can be to move, but in this case, you already you're done. It's weird, but all right, raiding party. Uh, let's see. This would be oh, activate geez. raiders. Then you set up a base star, two heavy raiders, five raiders, two vipers, and three civilian ships. Well, that's convenient. And then FTL failure. Um, oh, jeez. I think... And an would this FTL be a good failure? Time, would GG, this be a good man. time for me to use my uh, Starbucks special ability to cancel a crisis and pick a different one? Um, Probably. Yeah, I would say yeah. so, especially yeah. since yeah. we're ready to jump. And Wait, this, what is... Cancel. Why? What is this? Oh, because this yeah, will Immediately be... after... Oh, yeah. Yeah, I would do it. It's for game. A uh, Starbuck can, um, after revealing a crisis card, discard it and draw a new one. Oh, and I'm doing that. So that Hanger was the... accident. Oh, oh, that that makes sense with my recent uh, <laughs> <laughs> rapid departure. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Metal fatigue. Old equipment. Cheap bit of metal snaps. Drops a million cubit drone to the deck. Kills thirteen pilots and lands seven more in six in sick bay. So. We need purple, red, and blue cards, totaling 10, or else we're going to lose population and damage vipers. Hey, thanks for the subscription, Coop. Hey, thank you. 11 months in a row. Bam. Thank you very much for your contributions. And apparently I said something offensive. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Palmer. <laughs> Palmer became the stream boss, so uh, we're supposed to be spinning that wheel again. Um, so that's fun. <laughs> All right. Hey, this is all stuff I can do. So, who's on deck Purple, for red, um... blue. Uh, we have to start the check. So there you and go. And it starts with okay. Maggie. Okay, let's see. While you guys are doing that, well, actually, I'll wait, because I'll, I'll do it next time. Oh, but I'm going to keep the red, because I need it for the other thing. How many do we need? How many points? Ten. Oh, boy. Oh, ten. So we do need a lot, so I will put two cards in then. So, and you can put as many oh. as you in, in in as you want, right? Um, yep. 
We Never put mind. the destiny cards in, right? I, we did, uh, yes. Before you... Now there are four destiny cards. Or, oh, never mind. mind. Yeah. The cards, because someone else added them. So, never mind. Okay. I put in two cards. Gotcha. All right. We're good. Okay. Bobby's up. What's our current population? If you're trying population? to do maths right now. <laughs> mm -hmm. Our current population is eight. Mm-hmm. Uh, all right. Listen, people. <laughs> uh, you need to get your get your shite together. <laughs> and accidents mean lives, and we only have so many lives to spare. Um, I'm gonna Kinda make accidents. Yeah. <laughs> I'll do. Solid math, there, Ty. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm gonna put three cards in. Oh. Baller. That was a bad idea. But anyway, I've done it. <laughs> <laughs> as long as you can help with stuff that comes around again. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we might have gone overboard. Yeah. I was still pumped up from the from the last crisis we avoided. <laughs> oh, okay. um, I will not be contributing to this skill check. I don't have these colors. Because you're silent. Gotcha. Because I'm a politician, not I'm an engineer. Leadership in yeah, no, you actually have the I'm going to do this grunt work. Oh, jeez. All right. Come on, Boomer. Boomer. Make sure you play these oh, face you down. To, you have to show them face down. You're you're putting them up face up. Oh, I figured it would do that for me. You got to flip them first. You, yeah. I didn't look. <laughs> I didn't look. <laughs> I did. I totally looked. <laughs> <laughs> it's hard not to look because you just see it. I have it zoomed in. Oh, that's a lot so. of. <laughs> All right. All right. Before we lay them out, eyes, we're gonna look. we're gonna stay in suspense real fast. Before we lay them out, we're gonna spin the wheel because Palmer is itching. I I know he is to uh to find out. You should really get that checked out. Yeah. He's itching. <laughs> yeah. Well, <laughs> trust me, I know he is. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna spin the wheel. What did you give it to him? Yeah. <laughs> I, I didn't say that. I didn't I didn't deny it, but I didn't say it either. Uh, scouting mission. What does that mean, Oz? We get a scouting mission. Yes. Um, Palmer gets... Palmer's the stream boss? Yep. Gets to select someone to do a scouting mission. So um, gets to look at the top two cards of the destination deck. Ooh. And... Oh, wait. Is that how scouting works? Hold on. I, I picked it, and then I don't remember. Oh, here we go. Uh, look at the top card of the crisis... Or, Yes, look at the top card of the crisis or destination deck and place it on the top or the bottom. So. Oh, okay. So, so Palmer, while we're uh, while we're laying out the cards and, and resolving this crisis, you need to decide who is going to get to scout the crisis or destination deck to give us some uh, information or to give themselves information. Because if they're a dirty Cylon, if they're a fracking toaster, then um, then they may uh, keep that information for themselves. All right, while that's happening, let's lay this out. Oh boy. All right, so we uh, right. I'm gonna count up the non, the ones that don't count, okay? Okay. Six, seven. Oh wait, I think we pretty much got it because there's only one card that doesn't count. <laughs> yeah, I know, this is, we passed by like a lot. I think yeah, I that's what I'm, I'm counting, saying when, I'm counting 22 put, positive. Yeah. When you put three cards in, I was like, we might be going overboard because I put we two. way in. overshot, yeah. Maybe next time I should listen to how many cards people are putting in. Well, if you didn't drink so much, you'd get counties. Look. That's true. I am right. perfectly under control. <laughs> All right, so the pass is under no what effect. what de definition? Uh... <laughs> okay. Heavy Raiders are activated, so another one gets launched from the base star, and our jump preparation track is moving forward one. And also, Ozcor gets to scout. Thanks, Palmer. Ooh. President Roslin right. should lead from the front, he says. He is a right. he is a fan of democracy, I guess. All right, I will draw. I'll check out the destination deck. He's a fan of democracy. Okay. The destination deck is what gets us closer to Kobol. Our objective, humans' objectives, is to get to Kobol. So. Well, you're not supposed to. You not supposed to tell us what they are. You're just supposed to look at them and decide. I guess you can do what you want. <laughs> All right. Oh. Okay. 
not supposed to show us. Okay. Uh, I'm going go. to... Wait, I didn't show the card, did I? No. I saw you flip over the destiny thing. That I flipped over the destiny deck by accident. Oh, okay. I drew one card into my hand. So this one up here is the one I'm going to keep. I'm going to keep it on top. I have a good feeling. You got a feeling. I have intel that we can get very, we can get very, very far away from here. Uh, you might mind being a little more specific there, President. <laughs> All I'm saying is that <laughs> I, because I can't, I can't say. Aren't you like literally supposed saw. to only say like one word or something? <laughs> no, no, it's or not is like that. that. Am it's I thinking like of a different game? You're thinking Dead of Winter. Oh, okay, that's what it is. All right. Um, <clears throat> I like these portraits of us. Right. All right. So uh, that that you can Although thank Bobby for the overlay. You know. All right. So uh, whose turn? Starbucks' turn is done. So we're going to Adama. Admiral Adama. All right. Uh, where are we at on the jump track? Like, how far do we got to get before I can actually jump? Uh, we can we have jump to do whenever one... you want. Yeah, we can. You can jump now, but you would be risking a population. Uh -huh. If you want to jump now, go to FTL control and uh -huh. do that action. Otherwise, we can wait for a crisis card to give us a jump, in which case we auto jump and leave. And we don't risk population. You mean Correct. you mean because we'll advance on the track and then automatically go. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, they're not my ships, but I can't leave them behind. All right. So with that, I will instead do a different maneuver. What we got here? We got another heavy raider. We still got these three over here. Mm -hmm. So would it be a good move if I go to the weapon systems and command a fire? Yeah. Let's do that. Yeah, because we're not in like immediate danger of of doom. They're still pretty far away from the civilian ships, and the heavy raiders far away from boarding Galactica. That's right. All right, so because Starbuck right. took out that uh that uh raider, not raider, but mm -hmm. yeah. heavy raider. Good job. That would have it would have actually boarded the ship. Yeah, I know. Last turn. Bobby's saying had... good good oh. good job Starbuck because Ty would never say such a thing. I have <laughs> that right, so. Yeah, All right, so been... Cylon ship attacking Gal or attack one Cylon ship with Galactica, which who are you attacking? Uh, I'm gonna take out one of these raiders on the side. Okay. So go ahead and roll uh, on a three through eight. They're destroyed. Three through eight, so five. All right, you destroyed one of them. Sweet. Yeah, good job. You have good RNG luck. I'm the worst. <laughs> I'll probably roll like five times and not. <laughs> All right, can I draw a crisis? Yep. All right. Rescue the fleet. <laughs> the silence are waiting for us back there. How long will that take to calculate once we get back there? It's all time. Oh, I should let you read that. <laughs> the <laughs> Twelve <Cylons>. hours. <laughs> yeah. Twelve hours. <laughs> all right, so... Uh, oh, Admiral so this is not one that we uh, contribute for. You just... The Admiral chooses. Yep. Minus two population or minus one morale, and you place a base star and three raiders in front of Galactica and three civilian ships behind it. So front of Galactica is over here. I uh, don't want to lose our population, so I'm going to go with option two. Yeah, it's fine because we're actually going to jump. We're about to get the we're about to auto jump, so it really doesn't matter. All right, so we'll do that. All right, so minus one population, or sorry, minus one morale. And just as the uh, just as the base star arrives, whew, whew, pops in, we jump away. I can't make the noise. <laughs> yeah. All right, so we remove the base star, the heavy heavy raiders, dink, and then the the pilots, if. The pilots uh, move to any location, move back to any location in Galactica. If they want to okay. board Colonial One for some reason, uh, they have to discard a skill card. Okay. For so some reason. Back. I mean, 
if you no, want to you know. ch- if you want to chill with the prez chill with the prez yeah <laughs> what up prez yeah all right and we are now in the cold emptiness of safe space set the clock <laughs> definitely not the internet <laughs> All right, so back to me. I are these my religious supposed visions. to be out here? Are these out, supposed to be out here? Oh yeah, no. Uh, we can return them to the reserves. Okay. Yep, Starbuck climbs out of her climbs ships. climbs out of her viper and uh, heads over to the nearest bar with a smile on her face, ready to get her drink on after taking out the Cylon threat that was just about to board the ship. Rosalind breathes a sigh of relief on Colonial One, looks over to her assistant, Billy, uh, and on on comms rings in Adama and Ty and says, good work. Thank you, Madam President. (laughs) Just doing our job. Boomer will just follow Starbuck. Continue walking with resting bitch face. <laughs> <laughs> all right. It's her cross to bear. So, <laughs> that's just like her default state all the time. All right. So we have, oh, okay. So it's my turn. I'm going to go draw my set. A uh, reminder that there is a limit of 10 cards. So at the end of your turn, you would have to discard down if you still have any. Yeah. Well, um, if you could be helpful, you know, and not just hoard all your cards, that'd be great. I literally just drew another set of five. <laughs> I have a little plenty. All right. I know mean, you uh, just said that. You yeah, looked over. You have so many. I have one card. Okay. Uh, um, all right. So even though I, I'm, I'm, so I'm going to use my administration. The, sorry, I'm going to use the president's office. If I'm president, I draw a quorum card. Then I can draw an additional quorum card or play one from my hand. So to activate it, though, I, I do have to lose two skill cards. So I'm going to drop that one and this one because I'm very, very tired. I need a break, but there's no, there's no time to break, to rest. All right, let's see here. So do I want to do this one? Ooh, that's a good one. I'll hold on to that. Um, I'm going to play one of my other quorum cards then, uh, and I'm going to play this inspirational speech. I'm sure I speak on behalf of everyone in the fleet when I say thank you. Without your dedication, tireless efforts, and sacrifice, none of us would be here today. I'm going to roll a die, and on a six or higher, we gain a morale. Otherwise, there's no effect. Great. See so how good recover the see. Eight. Oh. All right. So on the bar. Nice. It worked. That was a nice Starbuck speech. Starbuck raises her drink. Towards the towards the speaker in the bar uh, says here. Well. All right, morale is back at eight, so we're fine. We're good. Oh, also, we need to actually jump somewhere. Forgot to do <laughs> that. Uh, Admiral, the admiral so, chooses. So you draw the two car- top two cards of the destination deck. Oh, you shuffled. Oh, sorry, was that not supposed to shuffle? No. Yeah, because I saw the top card and it was good. No. Uh, oh, Oz has really to go good. in and find that card. And hey, wait, 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 wait. Before you do anything, you can step the game back. Yeah, do that. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. You can reverse Slightly. the game. <laughs> okay, hold on. Or you uh, could just uh, hand me the card that you think was good. <laughs> hold on. Wait. Whoops. Okay. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Making sure there's okay. There we go. Wait, no, but that was that might have been shuffled. Hold on. Let there's me a proper jump effect. <laughs> yeah. mm-hmm. Okay, I think that should be uh, good. You right, should so have it like. Yep. You just do and this so you... that it refreshes and doesn't change anything, because that would be perfect for when the ship jumps. <laughs> well, <laughs> I'm pretty sure this is not the two you thought was good, <laughs> but uh, I'm willing to take from them. Oh well. Sorry. Right. Well, I can promise you, if one of these two was on top, I probably would have picked the good one. So if you just want to deal it to me, that'd be great. 
<laughs> All right, put those back in the deck. Put those back in the deck. Put those back yeah, in the deck. I'll find it. Are, let me put this. Oh, way. no, because then, here, hold on. Because otherwise, it, it's going to look like I'm just grabbing whatever card I want. So let me make sure. <laughs> <laughs> while they're doing that, keep... while they're doing that, I'm going to should... spin the wheel because uh, Josk, who just left, um, yeah. uh, uh, became the stream just boss do... and said that whatever it is, Maggie gets it. Um, just deal me the good card because I promise you I would pick it over ones that have two negative effects. Because <laughs> no, I can't do that. Oh, God, it's going to be something like terrible, me. knowing my luck. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, just notice how much uh, Rosalind is uh, paying oh, attention God, to really appearing. Cool. Being sure not to appear like a Cylon. So right. putting a lot of effort into that. Okay, I'm gonna. I just remember gave, who the traitor was. I just was gave a great winter. speech. <laughs> you did. Don't meta game, dead of winter. Those are zombies. <laughs> All right, so I just I turned morale back to eight. All right, now you can go ahead and draw the two cards. I'm also uh, I'm spinning the wheel. Okay. Here we go, spinning the wheel. Let's see what 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 happens. Engineering team. So hey, that's me. Yeah. Um, what is well, that, actually, what does that mean? Go ahead and respin. That would have been to repair a raptor or uh, a location on Galactica, but since we are fine, go ahead and respin. Oh, okay. Spinning again. Pretend that didn't happen. Turn back time like we've been doing over and over again. Executive dream, order. Executive order. Executive order. All right. And so Maggie executive gets it. Dream. Okay. All right, so executive order means you get to move and take an action or take two actions right now. Oh, oh right. That's one of the cards. I get to move and take an action. Yeah, or take well, two actions. I guess I will move to command and activate two vipers. That seems useful, right? Sure. Seems Unless, oh, um... There's a couple of locations around here, like the research lab, that lets you draw um, skill cards. I don't know if that what? might interest you as well, since I know you're low. Punching ships uh, is easily the most effective thing. I, I mean, after your turn, it's going to be mine, so. Okay. I think I'll be okay. Okay. Dunzo. That's actually cool. Great. I like that one. And Thank you, Josh. Okay, so you moved it here. Nice. Yes, All right, thank so, you very much. So, uh... This gets removed from the game. I think there's like a box that's like uh disc yeah, right here, the discard box. Adios. All right. Uh now crisis. We still need a planet. We're going here. <laughs> oh, where are we going? Yeah, where are we going? A barren planet. All right, we lose two fuel. What do I do with the other one? Uh, Roslyn. We we don't have much fuel left. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no. Um, just so you know, yeah, uh, or so our audience is aware. So typically it's um, it's eight distance to get to Cobol. We've cut it down to six, and since we cut everything down to three fourths of game time, uh, we also cut down all of our resources by um, by a fourth. So that's why we're so low already on food and just general supplies. Um, that said, uh, Roslyn is about to voice concerns to Saul Tai that the ship was led astray, but then all of a sudden, Ellen Tai, his wife, shows up. <laughs> oh, I can't believe Ellen. You. Oh, sorry, this is you. This is your line. Right here. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, I can't believe you're alive. Can't believe it myself. Don't even remember the last few weeks. It's weeks, right? Uh, All right, so. You might not want to say that too loudly outside of our, my quarters here. Please, uh, don't rouse any suspicion. I love you, Ellen. <laughs> I love you too, Saul. Uh, unexpected reunion is yellow, green, purple. It is a skill check that we have to do. Pass is no effect or fail, minus one morale, and the current player discards his hand of skill. I discard my entire hand of skill cards. Oh, that's not so bad. <laughs> no, that's awful, actually. <laughs> I have so many cards I can contribute. Well, I'll believe it when I see you actually contribute one. Same. I wasn't able to contribute <laughs> to the hangar.
Sure. I will not have this kind of suspicion on your president. What are you going to do about it respectfully, madam? <laughs> Adama, you can play skill cards to the check. Oh, right. Uh, all right. For the greater good. I mean, we need eight. Eight. Yellow, green, purple. I'm definitely not getting involved in whatever's whatever's going on here. Oh, jeez. Um, I have nothing to offer, fortunately. Who the hell would marry that? I have one old... card, but it's not any of those. Cards, so, sorry. All right. Um. Well, I'm busy in my uh, quarters catching up with my catching up with my wife. Um. So I I'm not going to contribute anything either. Is that what the kids call it these days? That's what I call it. <laughs> right. I'm going to contribute um, one. Only three have been contributed so far. Just so you know. I know. I know. I know. I just don't want to lose my whole hand of skill cards either. So. I have to be careful with my skill cards because if I get down to one, basically I can only have, the least I can have is two, or I can never have one card in my hand because I'm a drunk. And that's like- If uh, I contributed, it would be bad for you all. Yeah. My, my well, alcoholic already... trait says that if I ever have one skill card in my hand at the start of another player's turn, I have to discard that skill card. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that's funny. Um. Oh, I forgot to do my religious visions where I get to choose the two, the draw two crisis cards and I choose the one to resolve. Uh, whatever. Two Cylon. Can you remember your That would have probably been good. Ability? Yeah, I know. All right. Yeah, we got this. Six, eight, nine, Ooh, 10, 13, minus eight. Minus eight? What are you talking about? Yep. Minus five. Oh, wait, purple counts. My, okay. Yeah. It's so five. 13 minus 13. 5, we got it! 8! Nice! Excellent. So, pass, no effect. Alright. Alright. Uh, raiders would activate, except there's no base star. And there's no raiders. So, we're good. Um, Rosalind, before, uh, after this is all done, Rosalind is going to approach Salt High in his quarters, oh, sees Ellen, sees Ellen in the back corner and says, can we speak? Oh, gods. Uh, what is it you want? During the, during the attack, there was evidence that there may have been some work being done on the inside and not just from the friends of Adama's that, that died, but more. Someone, someone close, someone we trust. I think Adama might have been lying. Oh, hold on there, Madam President. That's a pretty serious allegation. I understand. I wouldn't be, I wouldn't be saying this if it wasn't, if it wasn't serious. <sighs> you know how I feel about the Admiral. I do. That's why I came to you. I need you to keep a close eye. Look. I need to I need to make sure we need to make sure that our commander, our admiral is not a Cylon. Look, I love Ad, I love the admiral with every ounce of my being. I've known him for as long as I can remember. But you're speaking uh these are these are tough times and I think it would be foolish not to not to at least keep my ear to the ground. I'll take what you said into consideration. Thank you. That is all. Now get out of here before I I'm, before I declare martial law. <laughs> all right. And she uh, turns and walk goes back to uh, Colonial One. All right, ends my turn. 
Hey, Adama, you'll yeah. never believe what just... <laughs> <laughs> My turn then, right? Yep. All right. Draw my set. Cool. And, well, this kind of sucks because there's no bad guys out here, but um, I guess I will to the research lab, I guess. That seems cool. Yeah, right now we are, right now we are chilling. We have some downtime. Okay. So I will draw an engineer. Yeah. Is that what you drew right there? <laughs> Get it? Mm-hmm. Is that your engineer stick figure? Um, and then at the end of my turn, I can look at the crisis. See what it is. Oh, wait, no. Do we do a crisis first and then, because it's at the end of my turn. Crisis is after it's at action. the end of your turn. Yeah. Yeah, but it says at the end of your turn. The whole turn counts with uh, crisis cards and everything. Yeah, so we'll do this first. Looks like more uh, Adama and Laura. Yeah. Combo. All right, Adama, this is your quote, and then me. Right. And then the Admiral chooses. Whoa. I'm going, I'm going to have to ask for your resignation, Madam President. No. Bam. Then I'm terminating your presidency. Oh! Die. <laughs> president oh, and the Admiral me. discard two skill cards. All right. The President and Admiral both discard two skill cards, or the President may choose to give the President title to the Admiral or move to the Brig location. What's your choice? Uh, we'll discard I two just... skill cards. Wait, I don't have that many skill cards. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> you can still choose it, but um... I'm gonna look at this next card privately. Yeah, no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna discard two skill cards. Secrets. Secrets. Okay, and then I have to discard two as well. Told you, it's because it's hard to read. It's because I told Adama what happened. Clearly. <laughs> Maggie, just double check. Did you know that if you hover over a card and hold down the alt button, it makes it bigger in your screen? Yeah, I do yes. know how to make it bigger on my screen. Okay. That does double not help checking. you if you're still if you're blind. Fair enough. <laughs> I just want to make sure that you weren't trying to read like by zooming in without using that. Cause... How do I put it at the bottom? Like this? Yeah, if you mm -hmm. select them and press G, it'll group them. Yeah. yeah. Um, the um, Rosalind looks at Adama and says you're playing a dangerous game here mm. <laughs> 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 I love it. I don't trust you as far as I can throw you. One wrong move and you go down. I don't have I'll time for your you. politics. I've got, we've got a fleet to protect. I don't protect. have time for Cylons. <gasps> All right. Um... All right, uh, base stars would attack, but there are no base stars, so that ends uh, that ends Sharon's turn. Yep, yep, yep. Next. It's all tie. All right. Uh, do we want to take uh, our, our first break for the evening now or after my turn? After my turn? We can take it now. Why not? Let's do it! <laughs> and uh, I'll take this eye patch off for a minute because it's... <laughs> yeah, I like that you got an eye patch when the picture of Saltai, you don't have an eye patch on your card. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, you know. Yeah, because he didn't get his eye lost yet. It's early in the season, man. Yeah, well. <laughs> uh... Look, it's time for a break. 
<laughs> time for a break. Let's take yeah. a break. All right, we're going to take a break, guys. We'll be back in how long? Five minutes? Sound good? Yeah. Five minutes. Yeah, sure. Um, yeah. And uh, and and then um, yeah, you we Clifton could. We already could... left. He's gone. <laughs> he's he's bounced. He's like I'm taking. I'm going to jump on this. I'll get an, I'll get six minutes. Um, <laughs> so uh, yeah, we'll do that. And uh, hey, we could spin the wheel when when we get back. If if you guys you can't spin the wheel willy nilly. Has yeah. somebody given you more stuff? No, I'm saying if if they make it happen. Right, then we could right. be spinning the wheel when we get I back. But either way, we'll be back in five minutes. Cassie, uh, making sure we stick to the rules there. <laughs> and, I uh, gave bits for this yeah. single bit. <laughs> that's, that's right. Um, but uh, we'll be right back. <laughs> 